David Murphy announced his retirement from football at the age of 30. Injuries played a part in his six seasons with Blues, where he became a firm favourite with the fans. After another lengthy spell on the sidelines this season, Murphy decided to call it a day, a decision he didn't take lightly. That's the, that's the toughest thing I've had to do in, in, my, in my whole life, really. Um, took a lot of advice from surgeons and, and club doctors and, and physios and, um, you know, I really took some time out to, to think about things and spoke to my family and, and um, you know, like I say, I've come to the decision, but uh, it's, been, it's been a tough one to come to. It was only a brief spell coming back, and I knew I knew things weren't right um, from the f the first game I played. I think adrenaline got me through it, but you know I was laid up for four or five days afterwards. I couldn't move. Um, managed to play a further you know four or five games, but had to come off in three of them because it was the the pain was that was that bad. Um, I, I I knew that something wasn't right. And what's the reaction been like from the players and the manager? Uh, I think some of the players were shocked because they, they weren't aware. Um, I've kept it pretty quiet, um, but yeah, they've, they've been great. They've been supportive. Uh, man manager's been fantastic with me. And uh, when we announced it via the, the club channels, we was inundated with messages of support from fans. It just shows how much of a, a fan favourite you were. No, it's, it was really nice. I'm I'm not on social media myself, but um, I've got relatives who uh, who will keep me updated with with the responses, and um, you know, I was really humbled about all the messages that were coming in. You spent uh, six seasons at the club. Yeah. And during that time, there was two relegations, a promotion, yeah. a Carling Cup win and the Europa League campaign. Can yeah. you quite believe it all fit into that time? No, it has. It's been a roller coaster six years. Um, it's a different club now to when I first came in. Um, but, you know, I've enjoyed every minute. You know, even, even the lows of, uh, you know, you take the rough with the smooth. But um, there's, been, there's been some good highs. The towering Ziggich. Oh, confusion! Can of Cups are always the highlight um, to win a major trophy uh, down here in England. It's 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 a it's a massive massive occasion. It was tough. Um, obviously, you would everyone loves to, wants to play in a cup final, but um, just to be part of the squad and um, part of the atmosphere and seeing seeing all the smiles on on, on the fans' faces, it's um, it was a special day. And during the lead up to the final, there's some memorable nights at St Andrews, Aston Villa, yeah. and West Ham. Yeah, they were. You know, obviously, beating beating your rivals uh, at home in the, in a quarter final is, uh, was special. But um, you know, the West Ham game will go down history. Um, but obviously, getting promoted back in two thousand and eight, uh, two thousand and nine was was a big was a big thing. And uh, the the European can campaign was uh, was a special moment also. Yeah, the Bruges one. Um, I think I got lost and ended up there. Um, but now that was great. It was a great occasion, and especially when Woody scored it on to give us the win, and then watching the supporters celebrate, it was uh, it was a special moment. What what were you doing in the six yard box at that point? I don't know. I actually don't know. I just thought try your luck. Um, the guy had switched off. who was marking me, and you know if you don't buy don't buy a ticket, you don't win the lottery. Just uh, finally what. What next for David Murphy? What have you got planned now? I, th I think first and foremost is just to, to regather and get over the disappointment of, of having to announce, announce my retirement. Um, you know, then I'll, I'll look to the future after that. Are you interested in getting in the coaching side of the game? Possibly, possibly. I've got, I've got interests outside the game also. Um, you know, but it's something I need to go away and think about and speak to my family about. You just have a final message for the Blues fans? Yeah, I, you know, thank you so much for all the all the lovely messages that that have been have been posted, and um, you know, I really appreciate all your support.